Today we have one of the most important discoveries about the map of GTA 6. It changes everything. Yes, you read the title correctly, Georgia could be coming to Grand Theft Auto 6. As you probably already know, on September 18th, 2022, confidential material from the next Grand Theft Auto leaked. We got an early peek at the next iteration of GTA and 90 videos with extensive information, including details about the location, main characters, new features, events, systems, and map details. It wasn't intended to happen, so Rockstar took down as much of the material as possible and put out a statement a day later addressing the breach. It was a year ago from the day I uploaded this video. Of course, it's the internet, so once anything gets out, there is no going back. The clips are being analyzed to this day and new details are constantly discovered by fans. The discovery we're talking about today could easily be missed by the casual viewer. It is a massive confirmation that Georgia will be in GTA 6. In my opinion, in this is one of the most significant details about the game. I don't want to show you the leaked footage out of respect for the developers, but also because this video might get taken down. I will describe what can be seen in the leak, however. It is also important to note that none of the details from the leaks are set in stone. This build of the game was not meant to see the light of day, so things can be missing in the final version. It is a prison. This prison can be seen for a split second in one of the clips with Lucia, where she is standing in front of a warehouse. This is an image of the prison in real life. It has many similarities to the one in the clip. It is called Augusta State Medical Prison. Augusta State Medical Prison is located in Grovetown, Georgia, part of the Richmond County. It is a medical prison that houses adult male offenders who need either medical or mental health treatment. Augusta State Medical Prison also gives mental health services to female offenders. The housing unit at this facility is set up similar to an open dormitory and can currently hold 1,326 inmates. Offenders who are incarcerated here can also participate in various academic, religious, and work activities. Inmates can earn their GED, take classes in adult basic education, and learn to read. Bible study and worship slash prayer services are offered by the chaplain's office, and vacational skills include laundry and food services, barbering, and custodial work. Offenders can also work in conjunction with the Department of Transportation, do in-house custodial and landscape work, as as well as warehouse and maintenance. Of course, we don't know how much of Georgia will be included in the game. However, this could mean that the map will be more expansive than any of the concepts you can find. We don't know how much, it could be a lot, but it could also be around the same as the concepts. However, it opens a ton of possibilities for new locations that could be included, including mountains, which Florida lacks. This could be one of the reasons why Rockstar decided to add it in the first place. One of the mountains can be seen in the Hank Swap robbery clip and it could be a part of the Georgia portion of the map, which I presume will be expanding north of Port Gilhorn. It is an area we don't have much information about, so it will be interesting to see how far north the border of the map is. I hope the official reveal of Grand Theft Auto 6 is around the corner because I cannot wait for this game. I believe Rockstar will come through. I mean, it's Rockstar, come on. You could say whatever you want about the milk in GTA 5, but when it comes to new titles, Rockstar has always delivered. GTA 6 is massive. So much new content and new cities, towns, mountains, forests, swamps, lakes, characters, activities, and so much more. You can see how much there is by the leaks alone. This game will define a generation. Subscribe for more. Thank you for watching.